so guys i've been walking i've been walking and i have not seen like i can't see anything like a restaurant or around here maybe just uh big hotels and i feel thirsty. i need water so guys i need to look for some maybe street food somewhere then quench my thirst and uh about the stomach i'm full i came prepared so guys let me let's walk around and uh, look for like uh, street snacks and uh, yeah see what we can do so i've been walking around i've not yet found any my mouth is already dry <laughs> so guys yeah let's walk along this street i think it was a moy avenue okay i forgot and so, so let's walk and uh, see whether we can find street food here in uh, this street so i think it's a more that's one of the things that it has uh, really worked uh, hard on, like uh, removing like those hawkers uh, along the streets in Haoli. And yeah, so it looks so clean, but wow, I'm suffering. I need some water. And so guys, so yeah, let's walk and see whether we can find some street food and try and see how they look like, what they sell. Yeah, something like that. So. I think I'm on uh, the other side of uh, like park. Yeah, heading back home because I feel tired already. <sighs> so let's do this. Uh, so guys as you can see i'm uh, seated here at the park okay sorry so guys i was walking around and i happened to find uh, this park i'm not sure okay i have forgotten the name I was told the name but I have forgotten the name but yeah I just realized something as you can see guys it's not normal to find uh, like uh, plastic seeds in a park so but as you can see around as I have shown you previously you can see there are a lot of plastic uh, chairs in this park and guess what I just uh, upon asking I just realized that uh, is someone lending letting the chairs at 10 bob like uh, the park is uh, right opposite like um opposite the bus station and i thought actually it's a very nice idea maybe i could share with you because uh if this person uh the park is actually has a uh, less chairs public chairs the park is supposed to have a uh, public chairs but if you can look around uh, the public chairs are just countable so like uh, the one uh, uh, the ones you can see they are countable and the park is too big and as usual as you all, you all know if you are from a certain town you can you know that uh, there are those women who are in the market most of the times they have some chamas they have some chamas not only women but even men young people nowadays they have chamas whenever they have their own business and those people need to meet on a daily basis there are some chamas there are some groups which meet every day so those people need somewhere to meet and to sit talk and uh maybe have a word like the ones behind me you can see there are some women who have gathered around here to have a talk on their chama to contribute chama is a, a group of people which they have uh, created they come together they contribute then they save then yeah give to someone else to someone among them then the next day they contribute and give there 
the money to someone else. So that's what we call chama. So those people need somewhere to sit. And uh, for that reason, those people cannot uh, go to hotels to rent a room. It's either they move from somewhere down on a tree, then sit under the tree, then sit top. So this person, uh, the owner of the chairs, thought of an idea of car lending those chairs. They bought, he bought the chairs. And so he lent, he lent those chairs at 10 bob. So very early in the morning, the person is here, the owner of the chairs is here, and he lent the chair. Any, he lent the chair. Any person who wants to sit, go to him. They give you a chair and you pay 10 bob after you are done with it. So, okay. What, are, what do I mean? Upon calculating, actually, this person actually makes close to 2,000 shillings a day. Because uh, if actually you receive 100 people sitting in a day, that's 1,000 shillings. So most probably there are more than those people who have uh, used, used those shares within a day, by the end of the day. So guys, have I'm seated this way? You see, I just got this chair. I've seated here. I have, whether it's five minutes, whether it's one minute, whether it's uh, maybe like... The whole day, that is 10 bob you have to pay. So guys, instead of sitting with your chairs at home, maybe in a room waiting for functions to let, uh, to help your neighbor, your friend with, you know, just look for this opportunity. If you see a park somewhere, a place where there are a lot, a lot of people who like meeting, just uh, jump into this opportunity. You might be making a very good income. I, I think I like it. I like it, it's a nice, a nice idea and I thought I should share with you guys. Look at these people, people just come, like you know cities, you know the life of a city. Some people are off their shift, they want to, they are waiting to get into a shift. They just come and relax, maybe someone was traveling, then they come and relax.